So here we have this rectangle where one of the corner has to fall on this curve and the other one's at the origin. The question is, what's the maximum area of such a rectangle? So I'm going to call this point um, A. The x-coordinate of that point is A, which means the y-coordinate would be square root of 6 minus A based on this function. That point is A0. So this is a rectangle. That dimension is A. This is square root of 6 minus A. So the area is a times square root of 6 minus a. So that's the function we're trying to maximize. So to find the relative extreme, I'm going to find the derivative and set it equal to 0. So this is a product. I'm going to use the product rule. So a times, it shows a maybe, because I have another a here. I hope that doesn't confuse you. Um, and then it would be da, sorry, da over da. That's just one. Uh, derivative of that. So to find that, I'm going to use the, um, yeah, I'm going to use that uh, uh, chain rule. So that would be half times 6 minus a half minus 1, because that's really a half. And then a derivative of 6 minus a would be minus 1 with respect to a. So that actually just becomes square root, but goes in the denominator, so it would be minus 1 over 2 square root of 6 minus a. We also have that a here, so this entire term becomes minus a over 2 times square root of 6 minus a plus square root of 6 minus a. And new denominator, 2 times square root of 6 minus a, and then product of those two, that would be 2 times 6 minus a, and the numerator becomes that, and then this is 12 minus 3a over 2 square root of 6 minus a. Set that to equal to 0, that piece would have to be equal to 0, and that would be when 3a is equal to 12, or a equal to 4. And this uh, rectangle would be 4 by root 2, if you replace a with 4. So the area, the maximum area is 4 root 2. Um, we didn't have to show that it's the relative maximum here uh, because it's multiple choice. The answer is right there. But yeah, if you found the second derivative and showed that it's uh, less than zero at that point, it would be a relative maximum. So the answer is 4 root 2, choice D.